Hi, if you're watching this video, then this message and guidance is meant for you whenever you find this video. Okay, Spirit, what is it you would like the person to know, who's ever watched the video to know and to be aware of? What message and guidance do we have for them today? Right. Completions. I've got here, as if for some of you lot, you've been suffering in silence, but something is now coming to an end. Do you understand? And we've got the world card. A new start, a new beginning is coming up for some of you. Something you thought you weren't going to get. You've you've hurt, you've been worried, etc. Or somebody could be worrying about you. You understand? But all I know when I'm looking at this, something is ending and something new is about to start. There you are, feeling very vulnerable. You understand? Right? Um, but you need to start trusting the universe that everything you want is going to be okay. And as I said, a new cycle, something is ending, you're stressing, you're worrying, but something is coming to an end. And as I said, a new start is about to be begin. You've been praying, asking, right, tapping into the universe. And when I'm looking at these two cards here, it's simply saying, ask. And you will receive. So either some of you lot are stressing and worrying about a situation. And you're not really asking. Now ask. And you will receive, they're saying here. Right? And no more um, holding anything in within and stop worrying. Because as I said, something you want is happening. It's going to happen. But you need to ask. You understand? You need to take charge. Take Be courage. Take courage. Take courage. Have some courage, have some faith, that everything's going to work out fine. It is going to work out fine. The four wands, do you understand? The four wands is there, right? Be honest and, and be honest with your communication. So all I'm going to tell you who's ever watching this video, stop stressing, stop worrying. Because remember, when you stress and you worry, you're actually, remember, look, look, bottom line is this, everything is energy. Do you understand? So we need to be careful of our thoughts and our feelings. So if we're putting out to the universe we want something and then we're saying, but I don't believe, pay attention, I don't believe it's going to really happen. When it doesn't happen, you have to reflect back and, and say to yourself, actually, I did say it, I don't believe it's going to happen. You got what you wanted. Do you understand? When you put out to the universe you want something, you want something to happen for your higher for your higher self, not not to steal somebody else's partner, wife, husband, whatever, you understand, but something for yourself, which is for your highest good, and you believe that you deserve it and you can get it, believe me, it happens. As I often keep telling everybody, the universe will provide. So be mindful of your thoughts. Now stop worrying. Stop worrying right and know that stuff are things coming in for you if you ask you will receive do you understand right and also as well as i said this card here you got to feel it you got to believe it i know you're feeling vulnerable right but you need as they said here trust in the universe and some of you out there are not at this present moment are not actually trusting in the universe you need to take that leap of faith now and start trusting. Anyway, what else, Spirit, would you like them to know and to be aware of today? What else, for the person who's currently watching this video, or the people watching this video, what else would you like them to know and to be aware of today? What messages and guidance do we have for them? Aha! That fell out. So this is for you. Who's ever watching this? This is for you. They say in here there's some movements. Things remember I said to you, you're sitting there stressing, suffering, silence, worrying, etc. Feeling nothing's going to happen. And I'm telling you, something is something is coming to an end and something new is about to begin. That's what that's saying here. Movement and choices. And you've got decisions. Do you understand? You've got some decisions now. What is it? Do I want? What do I um um what do I want? Do you understand? Don't worry how it's gonna happen, just know as we said, trust in the universe. Right now, this to me could be anything. Listen here again. This could be on your relationship, 
right? Your hearts open up. Some of you are going to have clarity. You're stuck in your heads, but that's going to change. Your hearts, some of you are, you had a broken heart and a closed heart, but that's changing. Relationships coming in, ground yourself. Some of you are feeling a bit insecure, right? And also as well, I'm looking on the material side of things, even though I don't like doing financial reading, but this is here. This is telling me that that's going to improve for some of you. Do you understand? All right? All that's going to improve. Now, what I'm trying to tell you here is this, this. You need to start believing. All right? And that everything you want is already, is already there for you. You just got to ask and believe. You understand? What did I just tell you? The manifestation. And this card here tells me when I'm looking at it, that, like I said, Remember I said to you earlier on about you're putting it out to the universe and then you say, but I don't believe it. You manifest, you manifest that. You man, you will manifest the block. So we need to stop that. We need to just pull it out to the universe. Don't worry about when, how, and that lot. This, no, it has happened. Because like I've just said about sowing, sowing new seeds. When I use the term sowing seeds, I'm telling everybody your energy, your thoughts, your feelings. This card here is all about manifesting, manifesting what you want. So as I said to you before, and I say it again, be careful, be careful what you, what you put out, what you say, what you think, and what you feel about yourself. Change all that, all right? Now, I told you, again, everything is a learning experience. And so what you're going through even though you're suffering, it's still a learning. You're learning, basically, when I'm looking at this, about, about yourself. Do you understand? Don't look at anybody else. Don't look at anybody else. Worry about yourself. You're not being selfish to worry about yourself. Because only when you... Only when you I've, got to, I've got to be careful. Only when you concentrate on yourself and strengthen yourself... Will you then be able to help others? So this learning experience is all about here. When I'm looking at this card here with this one, this is telling me, right, that some of you are learning about your relationship. You're learning that about yourself, learning to strengthen yourself, learning to open up, learning that you can love. Some of you feel as if you're not, you're not, some of you feel as if you're not loved. Some of you are going through a struggle when it comes to relationship. Now, I am, I'm a great believer in this. Never chase anyone. Do you understand? If somebody walks away from you or somebody's ghosted you, right, don't chase them. Just get on with your life because you have to look at it this way. When you came into this world, when you born, when you came into this world, was this person attached to you? Do you understand? Was this person attached to you? When you came into this world, without this person, can you still breathe? Is this person your oxygen? Learn to let go because some people come into our life so that we can learn how to let go. And we can learn, yes, I like you, yes, I love you, but I don't necessarily need you. You understand, right? Some of you have been given away too much of your strength, too much of your power, right? As I said, learn this learning thing is all about your learning experience what life has been teaching you there's some stuff here there's a lot of stuff here what life's been teaching you but some of you are not understanding and you keep repeating the same mistake learn from it learn 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 about yourself learn that you can be happy um with yourself you understand and you can manifest everything you want in life some of you need to clear clear right um certain things around you as i said your thoughts your feelings etc right learn about yourself clear clear your space clear your energy and when you do that you will be able to manifest quite a lot of stuff do you understand some of you need to take time out time out again this card here is telling me something is coming to an end a completion this card here is also telling me as i said you've gone through a difficult time right this card here is also telling me you don't need to learn about yourself because i'm reading that with that one you understand and you need to know that you've got everything within you to manifest the stuff you want because the reason why i'm saying that because this card here the um i know it's an old card 
but this orange here is the sacral chakra that color of the sacral chakra this is telling me as if you've gone through a lot but this is also telling me as if like it's it's about to come to an end you understand this card here tells me you've been enlightened you've looked at things now in a different way you've learned you've learned life's little lessons do you understand right and now you know you now know what you want and as i said to you arts the universe right this is like the hangman the hermit the hermit card and the hangman you went within you took you you needed you either went within or you're going to go within to work out what it is you want and as i told you before and i say it again the at the end result is this for those of you who learn and you understand and you let go and you don't let anything get in your way you've got the four ones coming a solid foundation once you know who believe me once you know who you are right people can't screw with you ah and i told you so told you the love card is here the love card is here right you're learning about love you're learning that you've got love and i'm telling you also as well harmony and balance is coming in for your life you've been looking back on your love situation right all i know and i tell you again someone someone when i'm looking at this card has ghosted you has pulled their energy away from you now they are also worrying they are also learning about the connection between the both of you, right? You can see that when you look at these cards and from the other cards, right? They pull back. They're suffering. Something. They want to come in because they've learned something about you and about themselves. Give them the space they want. As I said before, and I say it again, do not chase them. Once again, as I told you, the world card, something is ending. Something is about to begin. So maybe when we look at this, right someone like i said pull back goes to you and also you probably pull back goes to you but anyway that cycle is coming to an end you both looked at things differently and i feel that there might be communication coming you understand you need to start tapping into the universe tapping into the power of the universe who's ever watching this right there's stuff going on around you but you're not trusting you are not trusting in the universe the universe is sending you guidance information listen listen shut your mind down open your heart listen ground yourself you understand right and when you do that and you tap into the powers to be you'll be surprised what i said to you will come towards you triumph taking control of the situation you understand right i know you are very intuitive right and and i know what you're going through as well can be very challenging and confusing but i'm telling you now just relax some of you need to learn how to do meditation relax silence your monkey mind stop worrying about people and i tell you this and i told you before and i said and, and i tell you one more time for free never worry about anyone who doesn't worry about you all right be honest be honest and communicate. You know what I'm saying? They say exactly what it is you want and what you don't want. And the final card, look at that. Full circle. Who's ever watching this video, you really need to start trusting in the universe. That's the main thing you need to do. If you trust in the universe and trust in the guidance, what they are, what they are sending you and you are downloading, believe me, the world would be your oyster. You understand? You will be able to tap into anything, right? And um and pull down um information about everybody else. You will be able to manifest things for yourself. You can live the life of Riley. Do you understand? Look at that. I, I know I said that's your last card, but look at this. This is all about um allow those those of you who are waiting for someone to return and etc because you've got a connection with them allow the wheel to turn and i say again stop worrying stop stressing about them you understand don't even worry i don't i often try to tell people there's that saying i know you're worrying about someone and you're looking for one find out when they're going to come blah 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 and all that jazz right but there's that also that saying a watch pot never boils do you understand in other words when you keep when you keep looking 
you know, you put a pot on, you put a pot of water on, and you're and you're waiting for the water to boil. It seems like it's taking for ages. But when you turn away and you do something else, next you know you turn around, that pot has boiled. In other words, what we're trying to say is this: when you're constantly, constantly focusing on someone, right? You don't get no communication. The way to get communication from them quickly, right? Is don't focus on them. Go and do everything else because like I said to you at the beginning, did this person come, when you came into this world, were you attached? Was this person attached to you? Also as well, as I said to you as well, um, um, what do you call it? Um, my, mind, my mind's gone again. <laughs> as I told, said to you, don't worry about them. Do you understand? Do not focus. Do not focus on them. And if you want them to come towards you, get on with your life that's it they're not your oxygen they're not in your life at this present moment but you're still breathing aren't you move forward move on do you understand right and as i said to you trust in the universe that if you were two are meant to come back together right it will happen the universe will move everything so that you two will come will will, will, will meet up Right? You need to now, who's ever watching this video, the biggest problem you've got at this present moment, you do not trust. You do not trust in the universe. Right? And that's why you're suffering in silence. And that's why you are worrying. Right? You need to start learning to take that leap of faith. So if you don't like it when I when I when I told you, telling you this, but I'm going to tell you, start trusting. Start, start learning to trust in the universe and trusting in the download what you're getting. You understand? And don't overanalyze or think things. Anyway, I hope this resonates for you. And I also as well hope you understood it, even if it didn't resonate with you. And now, if you would like a personal reading, all the information is in the description box down below. All right? And um, you take care now. All the best. Bye-bye. <music>